Hello friends, today I will show you how can we uh, have a boundary, polyline boundary around hatches. So here in this uh, shape, we have only hatches, we do not have any boundary around them. As you can see that as I delete this, selecting hatches and press delete button, I do not have any boundary line. Okay, so what I will do? Uh, so I'll show you how we do that. So there is a simple command which is called hatch edit. You type hatch edit, press enter, and then it's asking me to select the hatch. You select the hatch, and you select the hatch, this window will pop up, and you should select recreate hatch boundary and select polyline and click OK. Select polyline because I don't want uh, to create region around the hatches. So, and it's asking me to, do you want to associate that boundary with the hatches? No, because I want to delete that hatches easily later. So, I will press N and for no, uh, otherwise, uh, that boundary will stick to the hatches. So, press N and press enter again, then again press OK. Now, you can see that the boundary is created around the hatches. You can see that, right? So, in this way, we create the boundary around the hatches which do not have any boundaries existing. So similarly, we will create boundary for that darker green patch. So again, press uh, the command hatch edit and select the hatch, enter, recreate boundary, polyline, no, no associative boundary. Again, enter and again press OK. Now our boundary is created around that hatch. So this is the simple way we create the boundary around the hatches. If that hatch do not have boundary, sometimes we get files like that. We don't have any boundary around the hatches. So this is a simple command to get the boundary. And this is useful to cut because polyline are good to get it cut on any CNC machine. So this shape can be cut via in-browse. So thanks.